What's going on everybody? Mr. AGZ here bringing you another live Wi-Fi ORS battle. This time it's up against Andy, also known as Takataka527. Taka Should be fun. We're going to go ahead and switch up our stuff. We're going to go to music number 9. Music number 9, and we're going to try this team out. Should be funny. Or fun anyway, that's a funny. Fun, so we'll see what happens. And oh my goodness, Andy's team is freaking amazing. So Andy's got... Some pokes that are the bane of my existence. He's got the, um, yeah, he's got issues here. We've got the Weevil. We've got the, uh, Kiram. Not Kiram. Wow, did I really say Kiram? Keldeo. We've got the Latios. He's got the Landers. He's got the Heatran. And he's got the, um, Manatra. So a lot of power to that team. What to do about it is the question. Is the good question. Be da ba bum ba ba da bum. What to do, what to do, what to do. Da -da -dum, ba -da -ba -dum, ba -da -dum. Let's see here. So let's go ahead and do... Yeah, let's do this. Why not? Here we go. This should be fun. So Andy's coming in with that team. I've got a team of Charizard, Gliscor, Ambipalm, Togekiss, Tyranitar, and Ferrothorn. So it should be a nice, interesting battle. Let's see how we do here. Like I said, trying to mix up some teams, but we'll see. We'll see how we do. I'm thinking he's going to lead with either Manatrix, possibly the possibly the Heatran, or the Landorus. We'll see. Here you go. Good times. <laughs> Music number nine. Wow, totally didn't expect it. Weevil lead is possible too, because Weevil could possibly do um, fake out and stuff. It's Manatrix. There's Manatrix. Well, boom. Manatrix is here. Here comes our Gliscor. Gliscor against this Manatrix here. What to do about it? What to do about it? What to do about it? Alright, so here we go. We've got Gliscor here against Ace here. Let's see what we can do now. It's a very good team there. And Manatrix is one poke that really causes me problems. Which I need to breed. I need to just take the time and breed me a Manatrix. So we're going to switch out Gliscor. Here we go. Switching out to Tyranitar. So here goes Tyranitar. Get that sand set up. And here goes Mega Manatrix. He's going to get the Intimidate off. Which we figured was going to be the case. So there's the Intimidate. Ba-bam. There we go. Here's that Hidden Power Ice, which we figured would happen. Yoink. Survival. Get that Sandstorm damage. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. So, not doing bad so far. Thus far. Thus far. <laughs> Gotta figure out how to deal with this Ace. What shall we do? Plenty we can do. Question is, how are we gonna handle it? What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do about it? Let's do this here. Oh, stupid me! I've got the wrong item on this guy. <laughs> Dang it! False switch happening. Oh, the pain! I'm gonna have to run a rock attack. That's lame. <laughs> That's really lame. Uh, easily predicting uh, Landorus is probably going to come out next. But oh my gosh, how did... Uh. <laughs> There's Rockets to Landorus. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. I really did that. Oh my gosh, that was fun. Probably did not expect it or want that, but it's what happened. It's what happened. Alright, so who to send out next here? Alright, let's send this guy out. So here we go. Uh, I need to charge my phone. Charging the phone time. We're going to switch out to Gliscor. Here comes Gliscor coming in. Here comes a U turn coming out. Ba Bam! Get that thing charged. The opponent, the opposing Rufus, heads out. Let's see what's going to come out. Uh, 
And here comes Pegasus. Pegasus is a Keldeo, okay? Aqua Jet, Keldeo, Keldeo most likely imminent. Who knows? Who knows? That Toxic Orb. Yay for Toxic Orb. Alright, what to do, what to do, what to do about this Pegasus? We're gonna watch as he withdraws Pegasus. Who's he sending out now? Here comes Potato! I love the name. Potato is here. The the uh, Heatran is here. We're gonna go ahead and switch out our cells. And we're gonna send out the one and only Ferrothorn. So here comes Ferrothorn. Ba boom. Nice and Ferrothorn coming in. How to deal with Potato? Now, Potato probably has Roar Toxic and Stealth Rocks, most likely. And a Fire Tech. Most likely a Fire Tech as well. So, how do we want to deal with that? Hmm. Alright, let's do this. Here we go. So, Ferrothorn, come back. And switching out to Togekiss. Togekiss coming out. Here comes a Fire Blast. We avoid the attack. Nice and avoid. Sandstorm heads down and out. Potato is here. I love the name. Potato. Potato. What can we do to Andy here? We're drawing the potato. Very interesting choice there. What's coming out? Here comes Ace. What is Ace? Ace is that Manatric thingy. So Manatric is back. Gonna get that Intimidate off. That happens. And we're gonna go ahead and Aura Spear him. Get a little bit of damage here. Damage. Yoink. That's actually a lot more than I expected. Sweet action. All right, so who to send out next here against Ace here? Ace, by the way, could have Flamethrower, so that could work out in our favor. We're going to switch right back out here and go straight into Tyranitar. He's going to set up the sand again. So yay for Sandness. Sandstream is back. Ba boom! And here are the Volt Switch. We figured a Volt Switch was most likely going to happen. There it is. The Volt Switch happens. And I'm predicting Landorus coming out. Show me Lando. Show me Lando! <laughs> Able to predict stuff is really fun. It does help you out. It also does help you know when you're screwed or when you're not. <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay sometimes. So here comes Ruckus. The Lander is coming back out to play. Gonna get an Intimidate off on us. That's a thing. That is a thing. So he's probably gonna U-turn out as we have seen that's what he has been doing. Lately. Oh my gosh. Oh, the switchies, senor. We're going to switch out ourselves. And we're going to go ahead and send out Ferrothorn here. So if he is U-turning, we're going to do quite a bit of damage. If he's earthquaking, eh. There comes the U-turn. Sweet action. Predictions. Little bit of damage. Little bit of damage. Little bit, a lot of it. There's the Rocky Helmet damage. Bam. And now Rufus is heading out. Or Ruckus is heading out. Now here comes Heatran, most likely. Potato! <laughs> I love the name, Potato! It's a really nice name. It's a really nice name. So Potato is here. How to deal with the Potato. The Potato, 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 Potato. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and do what I want to do here. That really wouldn't help. So let us go into. Let's go ahead and do this. Here we go. Might as well. So Ferrothorn, come back. And here comes Tyranitar again. Tyranitar coming in. And here comes a Flash Cannon. So now we know he does have Flash Cannon. That's going to be super effective. Huh. So Flash Cannon he does have. Yes, he does have Flash Cannon. Now we know this. We know this very well now. Um, he's gonna withdraw the potato! Potato! Withdraw, and here comes Ruckus again. Ruckus, coming back in! 
with another Intimidate. <laughs> I love it. Potato, potato. And he's got leftovers on this Ruckus. So there you go. So leftovers has now been revealed for Ruckus. What to do about Ruckus? What to do about Ruckus? Alright, let's go ahead and do this. Figure out a fighting attack is most likely imminent or an earthquake next. So here we go. We're going to switch out to Togekiss. Now that we know he's not Scarfed, he's going he's to throw the Stealth Rocks up. Interesting. So Stealth Rocks is up. Sandstorm's going to subside. Perfect timing for that. Well, boom. Gonna have that leftovers. Leftovers are there. Alright, so. Ruckus, huh? What to do about Ruckus? If we can do anything. At all. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna get our air slash off. Ba boom. Woo! -hoo get that crit hit. We get the flinch. Not even bad. I can't complain. Ba boom. So nice and damaged there. We will gladly take that. Of course. Of course we'll take it. Oh no! That's right, I'm trying to score. We're drawing the ruckus. Here comes Manatrix! Ace. It's gonna be Manatrix. There he is. There he is. The Manatrix is here. We get an intimidate off on us. And here's our air slash. That's not gonna do a lot. But bam, not even 50%. Not even 50%. Do I want to withdraw or do I want to come in now? It's questions, questions, question. Let's go ahead and do it. Might as well. Might as well. Telekiss, come back. And go for it, Ferrothorn. So here comes our Ferrothorn now. I'm predicting a Volt Switch, most likely imminent. Or a Thunderbolt. One or the other. There's Volt Switch. Bam. It happens. Which means we're going to have Heatran coming in next. We should. Boom, 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 with all the legendaries on this team. <laughs> potato is back. So there's the potato. Potato, 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 potato. <laughs> potato, 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 potato. You guys know what I'm talking about. Alright, so we could go into this guy and be okay. So let's go ahead and do it. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Ferrothorn, come back. I might have just made a boo boo. What's that? If you listen closely, you can hear the Heatran say, Potato. <laughs> so there you go. Fire Blast incoming on my Gliscor. Yoink. It's going to do quite a bit of damage there. It takes us down to 24. We have our poison healing, though, so yay for that. Yay for that, indeed. Yay for that. Alright, so, what to do now here against Potato? Potato! Alright, what is Potato gonna do? We're drawing the Potato. What's coming out for Potato? Here comes Bars for Eons. It is Latios. Latios is here. We're going to go ahead and get a substitute off. Surviving with 1 HP. And get that poison healing. Yay for poison healing. Hooray. Huzzah. Yay for that. Huzzah. And we're going to protect here. While we can. While we can. As we imagine a side shock or something coming. There we go. Protected. Poison heal. Get that healing. We need it. We need the healing. All right, let's see here what's going to happen next. Slyshot coming in. That should finish off the Substitute. Substitute's going to fade. Goodbye, Sub. And here comes... Okay, so he's Life Orb. Here comes our knockoff on Bars for Eons. So no more Life Orb for Bars for Eons. And we get Poison Healing. Yay for that. Huzzah. We're going to go ahead and run protect while we get the shot. Might as well. 
There's Draco Meteor. Very interesting choice there, sir. The Draco Meteor. I see you there. I see you there. I see you there. I see you there. Draco Meteor. Probably incoming, so now we know. How do I want to deal with the Draco Meteor? The incoming Draco Meteor. A few ways we can deal with it. Let's deal with it by doing this. Here we go. Glyscore, come back. Switch out our Glyscore. And here comes Ferrothorn. Ferrothorn coming out. Who we're, who we're hoping can take a damage attack. Here comes Draco Meteor. Survive it! Survive it, baby! Survive it! You can do it! He's not Life Orb! Yes! <laughs> wow, somehow surviving that. Special attack harshly falling now. Yay for that. That is awesome. Awesome. What is going to happen next year? For boss for eons. Taka taka. We're drawing bars for eons. What is coming out? What is coming out? It is potato! Potato is here! Potato potato. Potato potato. You get what I'm saying. Stealth Ross finally coming up for us. Late game Stealth Ross, but it is here. Indeed, it is here. So how to deal with potato, potato, the one thing that's really been causing me issues, really. If you think about it, it's been causing me issues. Okay, so let's go ahead and go this route. Here we go. Do the switch, do the switch. Fairthorn switching out. And here comes Tyranitar. So Tyranitar is probably going to go down here, but he is going to set up the sand for us. That taking us down to three damage does set up the sand. And here comes Overheat. Overheat's going to be enough to finish us off. So he's got Fire Blast, Overheat. He's got... What else do we have? Stealth Rocks. And... Uh, something else. Oh! Oh, he has the... Uh, Dang it, I forget what move it's called now. Dang it. Woe is me. Oh, well. Alright, so, potato, potato. Should I send out? I should send out. No, I should. No, that would be a horrible decision. What to send out against this guy? Because I just realized I don't have the right thing. Ba-da-boom, ba-da-boom, ba da, -boom, ba -da, -ba -da, -ba -da. Um, let's see here. What's the out? What's the out? What's the out? Let us... You know what? Screw it. Let's send it up. Why not? Why not? Here comes Togekiss coming in. Ready to play. Togekiss coming in. Let's see if he's going to switch out or stay in or what. We'll find out. Potato, potato. <laughs> I love the name, Potato Potato. The defensive team versus the legendary team. Who's going to win? <laughs> Who's going to win? We're trying. Huh. Okay, we're drawing the potato. What's coming out instead of the potato? Bars for eons. Coming out to play. Has that ribbon. It's gonna take some damage. And here comes an air slash on him. Air slashing away, and bars for eons is gone. So that guy I don't have to worry about anymore. We are gonna get buffed by the sand. Let's see what's gonna come out next. I predict a Manatrix possibly coming out, but we'll see if we're correct. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba -da Let's see here. Here comes Ace. Ace coming out. Ace coming out to take play. He's gonna take some stone damage. He's gonna get intimidated. Not that that's gonna matter much. Let's see here. What to do here about this Ace? Most likely a Volt Switch is most likely imminent. Most likely imminent. We'll see what happens though. Pokus, come back. And we're going to send out Gliscor. So here comes Gliscor. If he's running Bolt Switch, it's not going to affect us. So, Thunderbolt. Okay, that's not going to affect us either. 
So Ace is going to get buffed it a little bit more, which is okay. We're going to get our poison healing off. Yay for that. So what is this Ace going to do here? Let's see here. So withdrawal of Ace. Ace surviving. Definitely critical keeping Ace. Here comes Pegasus. Pegasus the Keldeo is here. Forgot all about Keldeo. Another legend on the team of legends. Gonna take some damage though. But that's unfortunate. Here comes our poison healing. Yay for that. Alright, so most likely an Aqua Jet is imminent. Stab Aqua Jet. So how to deal with that is the question. Actually, he could run a fighting attack too. He can do a whole bunch of things now that I think about it. So let's do this. Attempt it anyway. Hydro Pump! Oh my god, we're dead. Goodbye, Glyscore. We tried to predict it, but we didn't do it. So down he goes. Aw, and Sandstorm subsides. Alright, so now we gotta figure out how to deal with Pegasus here. Let us do this. Here we go. We're going to send out Ambipalm. I know Aqua Jet is physical. I know, I know. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and have Ambipalm out here against Pegasus. What to do, what to do, what to do. Alright, we're drawing the Pegasus. Let's see what's coming out. And here comes Ruckus. Ruckus is going to have the Intimidate happen to us. Um, he is going to take a little bit of Stealth Rock's damage. Get the Intimidate off. That's a thing. But we are going to get our Fake Out damage. A boom. Nearly enough to finish him off. Not quite. Not quite. Oh my goodness. So what to do about this guy? Uh, okay, so... Okay, so we've got to do this. It's really our only chance, really. So here comes Ferrothorn. Here comes Ferrothorn coming in. He's going to take a little bit of damage, and Ruckus is going to withdraw. It's hard withdrawal. Very interesting choice. Potatoes coming out, predicting the prediction. So there we go. So we're going to have to switch out again. Don't trust your instincts, says Mysterious Gaming. Now we finally get to break a little bit of damage on him. Finally. Finally, right? Alright. Okay. So let's do this now. Here we go. Switching out. Here comes Charizard. Charizard coming in 50% off right now. Here's that Fire Blast on the Charizard. That's going to wait. Survival. Charizard being mean and surviving. Being mean. Barely surviving. <laughs> Barely surviving is key words. Alright. So now we got Charizard here. Against Potato. So withdrawing the Potato. Potato Potato withdraws. Here comes Ruckus. Ruckus is going to come in with the Intimidate. He's going to take some stone damage. Oh, he nearly goes down. Dang it. No. Crap. That's okay. Here comes Charizard Y. Charizard Y coming in with the Drought. And here comes a Focus Blast. And it's avoided. And it's avoided. Of course it's avoided. That always happens to me. It's avoided. Welp. Welp. <laughs> Welp is the right words. So now we gotta figure out what to do with this ruckus here. We're gonna go ahead and just might as well run this. Here comes our solar beam. Absorbing the light. We're gonna light up this guy. What? And goodbye ruckus. Ruckus gone. 
What is coming out next here? Be dum ba dum ba dum. All right, so here we go. I'm predicting Sly Cooper. What the heck is Sly Cooper? Sly Cooper is the Weevil. Okay, Weevil's here. Weevil should be strong enough to take us out in one shot. I'd imagine, anyways. Or even the fake out should be enough to finish us off. Should be enough to finish us off. I'd imagine. Do I want to save Charizard? Do I want to save Charizard? I do want to save Charizard. But there's no point in switching out. Pursuit. Pursuit's probably going to be enough to finish us off. There we go. There was no point in switching out because of the fact that we would have died anyway to his Stealth Rocks. Life or Sly Cooper? I think that means he's got two pokes with Life Orb. I don't know. We'll see. Um, let's see here. What to do, what to do, what to do. So he ran that. Let us go ahead and do... do, 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 do. Hmm. There we go. Here we go. Here comes the Amber Palm coming in against Sly Cooper here. Taking that pointed stone damage. And yeah, there we go. So here we go. Run this fake out on Mr. Sly Cooper here. Ba boom. Did quite a bit of damage. Jeez. Get that flinch on Sly Cooper. Yeah, buddy, for the flinch. Yeah, buddy, for the flinch. All right. So what is going to happen next here? Amapon, come back. Pursuit, no! No! We're dead. Wow. Why did I not think that? I don't know. Sly Cooper losing some HP. Sunlight's going to fade. Wow, that was, just, that was just bad by me. Really, really bad. Here comes Ferrothorn. Ferrothorn's going to take a little bit of damage here. And I don't think we can survive anything here from Sly Cooper. I don't think so. I don't think, anyways. We'll see what happens. Dee -dee -dum -dum. Not with Life Orb. Life Orb should cause us to go down. But he's going to go down to us, so it may be a fair trade-off. There's a Pursuit. We survived! Really? What? I don't know how we survived, but we did somehow. So, that happened. We're going to use Rest. <laughs> somehow, the Rest works. I don't, I don't know how, but it did. Wow, 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 wow. Did not expect that at all. You can't tell me you expected that. Nobody can say they expected that. But honestly, Manatrix should be enough to finish off the battle here. Should be. Unless something very surprising happens. Here comes Ace. Why send out Ace? I don't get that move. Oh wait, Ace probably has um Ace probably has a uh, flamethrower. That's probably why. And if that's the case, that is a good reason. That is a very good reason to do that then. Overheat. Okay, overheat. Same difference. So overheat's gonna do it for our Ferrothorn. He's gonna go down and out, and our last poke should not be able to pull this off. Even despite the special attack harshly falling, we should not be able to pull it off. Because here he comes, Togekiss. Gonna take some stone damage. Ace should finish us off. Should finish us off. And I don't know what his other poke is, so we're just gonna go ahead and air slash out. It's our best opportunity. Thunderbolt should finish us off. Should. Oh wow, we somehow survived it. I don't know how. Oh, but we're paralyzed! It's over! It's over! Even if we survive, even if we were to knock out something, being paralyzed means we're gonna go down and out because the we're not gonna outspeed anything. Even with Choice Scar. The Heatran will come in and just blow our face away. So, in this case, the legendary team is going to beat the defensive team. Sadness. Oh well. Oh well. It wasn't bad. This was a very good battle here. Here comes the Flash Cannon. That's going to be it here. But boom! And Tokus goes down and out, and that is the battle there. So an awesome battle. Very interesting. The paralysis matters. <laughs> Everybody's saying. So good battle there. It was fun. Wasn't quite able to get around that. We're going to save that battle because it was a good battle. But let me know what you guys thought about it if you saw this live. I thought it was absolutely great. It was a great battle. Just could not overcome some of the legendary pokes. And another thing is, is we were not able to persist. We were not able to predict the fact that the other team had the, uh, 
we were not able to predict the fact that he had, uh, what do you call it? Or for some reason, we predicted wrong about the Kelio, but that's a thing. It happens. All right, guys, remember, the road may be rough, but the journey will be unforgettable. Until next time, catch them all. See ya!